Well, hello and welcome, people of the internet. And uh, it's your boy Roar Extreme back at it again with another Medieval Dynasty episode. And again, <laughs> I'm loving this game. Now, um, we're actually doing Alwyn's story right now, so he wants us to talk to Sambor. Um, I think I've collected all the berries here. So. When we left off, uh, I just spent the night berry collecting. Um, so I got like a thousand from just collecting the berries overnight. So they sell for one gold per berry, but you get like hundreds and hundreds of berries per uh, um, like patch of berry bushes like this. So I've collected a few while uh, heading here to Sambor. So you see here we have 267 and we're at 7,300 in gold. Now let's do a bit of questing and uh, probably we'll do a bit of exploring in today's episode as well. For now let's go ahead and uh, collect these berries. <laughs> no. we'll, we'll, we'll go ahead and uh, help out our friend Alwyn and uh, the quest tells us to talk to Sambor because Alwyn apparently when he lost to um, the bet multiple times in terms of who's the better archer uh, he quit <laughs> he quit being an adventurer and, and uh, went back to farming and he doesn't look very happy so we're here to help him out uh, the quest tells us to talk to Sambor for some reason probably that he has an insight uh, since Sambor did taught our friend Alwyn uh, all about archery and stuff so we'll go there after we collect these berries we're gonna sell these berries to him as well um, I think he still has a few hundred gold in him uh, since per season there's only like a limited amount of gold per shop that you can exploit so meaning if there's like a thousand a thousand two hundred uh, gold in that shop per season then you would only be able to sell merchandise up to that point you won't be able to get like nine thousand ten thousand just by selling to a single shop you need to actually talk to other shop owners so Sambor's this way Oh, apparently he's not a home. He's out here hunting. He's our clay stuff. Here are berries. Come on. It's summertime, so there's no better season to actually collect berries. Okay, I think Sambor's move in, as you can see in the compass above, is probably following a deer that he just shot. You'll often see him actually doing those stuff um, whenever you try to visit him. So he's out in the field, he's hunting. You'll see him draw his uh, bow and arrow, shoot an animal, and follow the animal, and then shoot him again until they die. And he does collect uh, the uh, the carcass. But that is a way as well to get yourself a free lunch. Like if you see him shoot down an, uh, an animal, you can actually skin that animal. And your dynasty reputation will not drop. I think it's another way of getting iron arrows since he'd be shooting that animal and you get like two before the animal dies. You get like two iron arrows coming from him but that will be marked as a stolen item. But it doesn't affect your dynasty rep. See? Boom! He killed that deer and he's going to skin it. See, Iron Arrow. Let's wait for him to skin the buck. What? Dude, you're so slow. Greetings, Great Hunter. I come in peace. 
What do you want? Well, right to the point, all right? Do you remember Alwyn? Of course. Well, do you like him? What are you up to? Look, he's a good hunter, but it hurt him a lot when he lost against me. And why are you telling me this? Why would I care? Sitting alone in the woods must be exhausting in the long run. It can be. Sorry, but you won't get any younger. Wouldn't you need some kind of apprentice? Hmm. I would be grateful if you didn't kill me now. I know what you're trying to do. I'm not stupid. The truth is I could use some help. I feel it more and more every day. It's a hard work. That's great. I'm going to tell him. But I don't need a wimp that just gives up when he fails. Well, you can give him one more chance if he comes to you. It means he's learned a lesson. Fine, but he has to bring me something special. I want to see that he is ready for what awaits him. Well, he will. Thank you for that. I'm not doing this for you. Now get lost. Sambor doesn't like us. <laughs> so see, he has 1,258 gold. We sell him this 558 berries that drops down so meaning we only have 700 gold to exploit from him by selling merchandise 690 uh, I don't think I have anything else to sell you he only has two iron arrows for sale why Well, I'm not going to buy that anyways, we'd be able to forge that and stone arrows just does the job. Okay, let's try to tag this deer. Well, the deer ran. Mm, how about this one? Okay, so talk to Alwyn. The best way, the fastest way, is to go to Unstuck. And see there, Gustovia? We'll go to Gustovia the short route. <laughs> With a little bit of airtime there. And some fall damage here. Look, tell me what kind of gamer doesn't test out fall damage in the games they're playing. <laughs> Dude, whatever game you're playing, you know that you're always testing fall damage. I was playing Dragon Age Inquisition, I always jump from high, high areas. I, I don't know. Is it just me? I don't, I don't think so. Everybody does it. Everybody does that in whatever game they're trying to play. As long as there's like a few feet off of like whatever, you try to jump. If you can save your game, you save your game and then you jump. You still jump. <laughs> don't tell me otherwise. So where's Alvin? Oh, he's back in the field, by the way. I don't know why I went straight to Unigas. Or Noegas. Hey, Owen! 
Alright, that's enough, get ready. For what? Sambor needs you, he's already old and he's looking for someone who can take his place in the future. Did he tell you that? Well, maybe he didn't use these words exactly, but I kept the meaning. And what does he expect of me? That I chuck all and become a lonesome hunter like him? The best one in these lands, yes. Don't you want this? Sure, I wish I could. I loved it. But it's not that simple. Sure it is. You're a grown man. It's time for you to start living the way you want. Are you saying that if I'll just go to Sambor, he'll make me to his journeyman? Well, maybe not just like that empty-handed. You could hunt a Weissant or something. And where do you find a Weissant now? It was Sambor who always tracked animals. Don't be afraid, my friend. I know exactly where you can find them. Thank you, but that doesn't change the fact that I don't even have a bow anymore. Alright, I can do something about it. I'll bring you a really great bow, but promise me something. What? That you'll stop doubting yourself. See what a good friend we are. Deal. I will be back soon. So, what do we need? A re recurve bow? I don't even have the schematics for that. Are we too advanced in the game? For Halloween story? That's a bummer. Recurve bow, pickaxe. Yeah, I don't think. Oh, the crossbow is in Smithy too. Yeah, the recurve bow is in Hunting Lodge too. We don't have the schematics for that. We wouldn't be able to buy this yet. Um, hmm. Can we buy it from someone else, the recurve bow, and then bring it to him? That'll do. That'll work, right? Huh. Hmm. Deliver to Alwyn. Oh, I don't have that yet. Uh, journal. So it says here we need to recruit more. Uh, this doesn't have anything. Probably let's go ahead and try to do a bit of adventure. Let's go to Hornica. That's like the furthest down south that we can go. Probably they have quests for us there. Or good villagers, right? Let's see, so management, uh, simple house, I have two of three, two of three, one of four, and then zero of three. Oh no, the simple house is me, one of four. I have a simple house, zero of three, that we can assign one male and one female. So let's go to Hornica. Let's go to Hornica and see what we can find there. Hey, you know, who knows, they might have a recur recurve bow or something. We can give Alvin. They might have quests for us, I doubt, since there's no exclamation point there. But we want to go furthest south to Hornica. Now we're going the right direction, right? Here. We'll go to Hornica. Hornica. Name reeks of in the window, but that's where we'll be going to Hornica. <laughs> oh, look at that! We got a nice stream flowing. Where we can drink water. Probably let's have a quick snack. Uh, fat bread. And let's gather some of these berries to bring to Hornica, right? They better have merchants there that would buy our merchandise. 
Oh, they would. They, they will have those. Each town will have their own cellars, right? Cats are jumping around. You know, it's summertime, so it cats will be jumping. I guess they do that even even though it's not summer, right? See, the cats are breaking everything. And they always do that whenever we're recording, guys. Always remember that. If you have cats and you're recording, they'll do everything that they can to destroy your recording since they're cats. That's what cats do. They'll be loud and noisy whenever you're in a meeting. And then they'll destroy stuff whenever you can't stand up. Now, how much berries do we have? Uh, uh, 172? getting late so let's go ahead and head out to the next berry bush now we need to get to Hornica before dark since we want to be able to talk to people right after dark they'll not be talking to us they'll be Head into bed, so we need to get there before dark. We have thousands worth of gold, but berries are still enticing. <laughs> because the thousands of gold we have came from berry picking okay so let's head down to Horniga another berry bush Now these are ripe berries, so meaning we can uh, consume these uh, like so. So as you can see, 0.5 food and one water. <laughs> That's just a waste of gold. So you can go to a tavern, buy flat bread uh, from the money that you'll earn by selling berries. You see, you'll consume 40 berries for the hunger amount that the flatbread will give you. And flatbread doesn't cost 40 gold, so... Selling berries will net you more money than actually consuming them for food. It provides you water that the flatbread doesn't provide, yes, but the game has rivers and water systems that you can drink from that you're not going to be poisoned so doesn't change anything if you sell the berry I think we're near Hornica now right 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 Hornica yeah Hornica all right these are Wysons right Wysons what? You can't cross there. <laughs> Boom! 
<laughs> just went flying. Takes a lot of arrows to kill these things. So we're using our, our second longbow now since the first longbow, the reason why I was shooting things with that is it's about to die. So it's about to break. So since we're using the second bow now, we don't have to bring an extra one with us. Okay, let's get back on the trail and go to Hornica. This is the path to Hornica, right? I shouldn't be getting these berries. It's almost dark. So, from Onokoho's video, so he went straight here to hunt the bear from Hornica. So, meaning we're in this path. We need to just follow this path. That should bring us to Hornica. But there are wolves here though. There are deers and there are wolves. From his video. From what I watched. So. Uh, let's best be careful. And again. I'm not wearing. Headphones. So. I'll not hear the howls immediately. <laughs> you know, I'm trying to talk to you guys and then try to listen for wolves. That's a very difficult feat to do, especially if you're not wearing headphones. Again, we should not be collecting berries since we need to get to Hornica as soon as we can. This is the way to Hornica, right? Right? Tell me. No! We need to head south. That's why I was like, why am I only 400 meters from Alwyn? We'll take a bit of shortcut here. Uh, where are we now? No, we need to head further south. Yeah, southeast. Can we make it there? With good time that the shops are still open. See there? Wolves. <laughs> don't you howl at me. So, uh, yeah, I don't think that we'd be able to make it in time so that the shops are still open with these wolves on the way. Um, probably we'll camp out. Uh, we'll make a, a camp outside. Um, no, we'll make a camp outside. Just uh, fire. Campfire. You ain't gonna kill me, son. I don't think that the spear is hitting him. Let's test this out. See? It's not hitting him at all. There are more wolves? 
Okay. Now, where were these wolves when we were doing the previous quest? <laughs> Did they all move down south? Because we've been hunting them down north. So far, how many wolves have we killed? Five? Six? Can't tell. These stone arrows are expensive, so we want to pick those up. Yeah, that should do it. Uh, Hornica, here. What? What? <laughs> huh? There's another one right here. <laughs> There's a lot of deer. Okay, so probably we can just collect berries before we go to sleep. So we'll camp out. Uh, we'll make a campfire. A, ca a small campfire just to sleep out um, so that after we sleep it's going to be morning why does Hornica have to be that far south I don't know anyways we're going to make our campfire right here sticks too close this is still too close for you huh um, how about near this berry bush Still too close? <laughs> There's a campfire right inside the village, but they wouldn't allow us to use that and sleep there. <laughs> Wow, the cats are just breaking everything. Yeah, they'll get a piece of me right after. No worry. See, it's morning. Now we'll go ahead and... Where's the village? Where's the village? Oh, there. <laughs> we'll go ahead and sell our berries and try to check if there's any quests or probably someone selling a recurve bow, right? So this is Hornica. They have logs there. 
They have berries inside. Wow. That's nice. Probably I'm like at 600 berries right now. 600 close to 700 berries. And see, with one berry per, see that's 775. One berry, uh, one gold per berry. That's a win, right? That's a game changer. That's a game breaker. Let's see, so we have a shop here. Uh, so Carolina is where? Where's the shop? Inside here? Oh, okay. Carolina's the same mistress. How are you doing? How's your job? Well, you you love your job, huh? Show me your wares. Buy all my berries. <laughs> yeah. So she has pouches. Uh, Simple backpacks. I think we have that, right? Simple backpack and a pouch. Yeah. Uh, tunic. I think she sells the same thing as. Oh, lean and thread and lean and fabric. Lean and threads. Huh. So she has these stuff for sale here. Okay, that's good to know. I'll go for now. You bought my berries. That's good. Let's check the other shop. There should be another one around here. So that's her. There's another one. Helga. Mm, no, Jan. 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 Is a smithy? Iron shovel. Hmm, interesting. Iron knife. Crossbow! Ah, but we don't have bolts yet. Dang it. Hmm. He has iron bolts for sale, but that's expensive. Um, hmm. You know what? Let's buy the crossbow and just put it in our stash probably at uh, at home until we get to the technology we can create iron bolts or even just stone bolts and then let's buy pickaxe probably two let's try to start um, getting hammers I don't know I mean getting iron but hmm probably just one then iron hammer we might need uh, two of those. We have tons of money. Why not just spend it, right? <laughs> two iron axes. Yep, these are heavy stuff. But we'll buy it for Jan. But still no recurve bow. Um, let's try to check out this other shop. Not you. Uh. 
Helga keep, keeps on moving. <laughs> Is she inside one of the houses? Is she inside this tavern here? Yeah. Oh, they all have their jobs here, huh? She doesn't like the weather, but she loves her job. Okay. So nothing special about what she's selling. Uh, okay, so there's no recurve bow, <laughs> there's no quests. Uh, but we were able to find Hornica. So I guess let's uh, go ahead and cut the video from here and uh, we'll pick up uh, next video in Hornica as well and we'll go ahead and uh, try to venture out more. Alright, again, it's your boy Roar Extreme. If you like the video, of course, don't forget to hit the thumbs up icon or thumbs up button. And you might want to consider subscribing as well. Leave a comment down below. That definitely will help the channel out. And uh, that's all for now. I bid you adieu.